From beating the world champions and grandmasters in chess, poker and go. But Labradis is just too good. I can pretty confidently just humbly admit defeat here. A linked group of your stones that surrounds some empty territory. It's not a good sign. You're taking over the strategic and military decisions. Artificial intelligence has surely taken the tech world by storm in the last couple of years. Not to mention the late frenzy of OpenAI, ChatGPT, Midjourney, and more. AI is turning out to be a head scratcher for even the most equipped experts in the field, while excelling and even in some cases surpassing our own expectations. We are well into our fourth dinner debate and everyone is upon the table. And the point of argument is an old one AI good or AI bad? The rapid development of AI has caused the most polarized views around the world and you always get responses of either euphoria or paranoia. Depending on who you ask the question, how do you feel about AI? I genuinely love the process of manipulating people online for money. Social manipulation is one of the biggest threats of artificial intelligence according to a 2018 assessment on potential misuse of the technology. As politicians increasingly rely on these platforms to advance their agendas, this worry has come to pass. Pretty much all the major social media platforms use an AI-charged algorithm to flood users' news feeds with material relevant to previously seen media on the platform. The algorithm's failure to weed out hazardous and misleading content is targeted in criticism casting doubt on the big tech's ability to shield its users from harmful and misleading content. Considering how deepfakes have infiltrated the social realms, online media and news have grown even murkier. As a result, malicious actors now have a new channel for spreading misinformation and war propaganda, creating a nightmare in which it can be extremely difficult to tell the difference between reliable and false news. The major corporations are already adopting tools like ChatGPT for customer services. The jobs like customer feedback, copywriting, and web design are going out the window due to the advanced and a blink of an eye performance deliveries. Amazon, McDonald, Walmart are putting up AI for the accurate predictions of consumer choices and revolutionizing their business model of customer above all. And soon, every other company will follow suit. Technological breakthroughs have far too often been used in military conflict. Some are eager to act now before it's too late when it comes to AI. The trajectory of AI weaponry is clear. Autonomous weapons will eventually replace Kalashnikovs. This is especially true if any significant military power pursues the development of AI weapons. Some of the most powerful countries in the world have contributed to a technological cold war as a result of the development of destructive and sophisticated weaponry. The threat increases when autonomous weapons end up in the wrong hands. Many of these new weapons pose significant risks to civilians on the ground. AI is coming to Industry 4.0. It will soon rewire the whole industry wheel with a new and adaptable production process. We have already seen some of the mega projects being carried out by the AI bots. Well, enough with the grim picture of the apocalypse from the terminal. Well, let's look into it anyway. The most in-depth application of this technology will be in the medical industry, which is now being developed to ease the diagnosis of patients with particular ailments, aiding on surgical procedures, 
reducing risk factors with anesthesia, post-operative complications can be taken care of by the AI. Other than medical procedures, lengthy work such as managing maintenance systems, accounting, information inquiry, AI-enabled chatbots and nursing bots can greatly improve the efficiency of operational processes. In finance, AI is frequently used to predict benchmark interest rates like short-term and long-term government securities, making investment decisions far more accurate and risk-free. Indicating a tail loss pointing to the 2008 market crash is AI's most spectacular contribution, even though it wasn't applied at the time. AI can help prevent systemic crises in this way. If you want to feed the world in 2050, then the next 40 years we need to produce the same amount of food as we did over the last 8,000 years. You'll never guess what's happening under this hood. A robot is self-targeting weeds and killing them. These things have never been done before, anywhere, in any field. AI can simplify the most difficult and common activities in the agricultural sector by enhancing already adopted technology. When used in conjunction with other tech, it can collect and analyze large amounts of data, determine the best course of action, and even start the process. Autonomous robots are changing the way we farm and are going to be essential in feeding our growing population. To sum it up, we are still at all of the capabilities of artificial intelligence as they move in a hot potato handoff motion from one phase to another. The policymakers still don't know enough to carefully curate the laws to keep AI on a leash. Jordan Peterson put it well. He compared this AI revolution to the printing revolution in the 15th century as to how the 7th century's old revolution uprooted the whole socio-economic structure around the world and installed a new one that we still function on today. AI doesn't have to be evil to destroy humanity. If AI has a goal and humanity just happens to be in the way, it will destroy humanity as a matter of course without even thinking about it. No hard feelings. It's just like if we're building a road and an anthill happens to be in the way, we don't hate ants. We're just building a road. And so goodbye anthill. We started our dinner tonight with the question if the benefits of AI outweighs the dangers of it. We can only answer that question in retrospect. Let us know your hot take on the age of AI and how we can move past the fear of it. Feel free to join our next dinner. Till then, live the dream.